Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to Rams Life YouTube channel. My name is Tiara and I am here to bring you a new video. As you can tell by the title, today I'm going to be explaining some apps that you should download as a freshman college student here at CSU campus or at any college. So to start off, there is a glare in my glasses, so I apologize for that. Um, but I did break, I have my little clipboard here, and I did go ahead and break down um, the apps into sections. So I categorized them into the transportation, class, and dorm categories. And I'll explain them a little bit more as we move along. So the first category we're gonna jump to is class. This category is specifically for the apps that you need for classes. Um, so the first one to start off with is the Canvas app. This app here allows you to see when your grades are due, it allows you to see when to take quizzes, it allows you to communicate with your professors. This app is a necessity and I feel like every student here at CSU or your college uses this app, I feel like it's something that you need to download on your phone. It's super easy to navigate as well. They have the drop down menus here at the bottom of the screen and you can click through to figure out what you need to find. The most important one to me is the calendar. It allows me to see when my assignments are due. It also allows me to see how many assignments I have throughout the week for all of my classes. This app is also a necessity to download because let's say you forget an assignment and you forgot that it's due at 11.59 p.m. Canvas will literally remind you about the assignment and you can hurry up and jump on it because it's on your phone. You don't have to worry about bringing out your computer and try to gather everything up. All you have to do is open the phone and boom, start working on the assignment as soon as you can. The next one that I have under the class section is Classroom. Google Classroom is it's not as common here on campus, but it is common because some of your teachers will want to communicate with you through Google Classroom. It's also very easy to download. You can download it on Android, iPhone as well. It's also a place where you can do Zoom calls as well instead of having to download the Zoom app, which is another thing I'm going to get into. This is very important because if you live somewhere like me and it snows and class is canceled, sometimes they will schedule your classes online and Zoom is very easy to download and it's really easy to sign up for. All you have to do is log in and you could type in your school email address or you can type in your personal email address and it's really easy to join calls. This app is super easy to use and I feel like it's definitely a necessity when it comes to a college student. Next, I have Google Docs or any type of app like such as Pages if you are an iPhone user or Docs if you're an Android user or you can use that as well on iPhones. But for me personally, Google Docs is a necessity. Sometimes I don't want to whip out my computer and it's just a lot easier for me to go ahead, start typing it up on my phone or if I need to put down a note instead of having to use the note app on your phone. I feel like Google Docs is really important. It's also really handy if you are a person that does not like to be on your computer. And if you are on your phone all the time, it's easy for you, easy for you to get your assignments done and maybe your essays. So that's why I encourage you to download Google Docs as well. So oh, moving on into the next section, we have transportation. This category is specifically to get around campus. So here at CSU, we actually have a few things that we can use. We can use the bus, but they also have this app called Ram Ride. And this actually plays into the Lyft app. But you should download Ram Ride because it lets you know when bus hours are leaving. It's also a service where sometimes around holidays, they will give you free ride if you put in the code at a certain time. And it's really handy, especially this year for Halloween, they did that. And it's a lot safer than using a Lyft or an Uber just because it is going straight through the school app. Now moving on to Lyft and Uber. This is another easy app that you can download. It's super convenient, especially if you're trying to get somewhere that's not as convenient and that's not walking distance. It's very important that you download Lyft and Uber. Also, you do have to keep precautions in mind because it can be a safety issue but this app is super easy to use all you have to do is sign up with your email or you could sign up with your phone number and right away you're already able to start ordering a ride around campus or around the area next thing that is a necessity is the spin app this is a scooter app that allows you to rent out scooters for a certain amount of time and based on the amount of time that you use it for is how much you have to pay it's actually very inexpensive i believe i did a 20 minute ride and only cost me about three dollars so it's not too bad it's very convenient especially here at csu campus we have a lot of scooters around 
and if you live by certain halls they actually have bike racks that keep the scooters in those areas so downloading the spin app is super convenient it's super affordable you don't have to worry about when your uber driver is going to come the spin app is always there and the scooter is always ready for you to go the only downside of this one is that it's kind of hard to find scooters at certain time points especially if it's late at night because a lot of people rent out the scooters at that time but other than that i suggest downloading the spin app it's super convenient and it's super easy for you as a college student next let's get into the dorm category so this category is specifically apps that you need while living in your dorm and first we're gonna start off with food because who doesn't love food the first app is grubhub uber any type of food app but the one that i mainly suggest here on campus is grubhub there are many places on campus that have express lines you can go through those express lines if you download the grubhub app and you can already place your order that way you can go to the dining halls and pick up your food and head about your day some places that do this on campus is Braden hall Durrell, ram's horn and many more i definitely suggest downloading grubhub because sometimes on the weekends there are dorm halls that are closed and sometimes it's just really hard to figure out what you're going to eat and when you download the grubhub app it actually tells you what dining halls are serving what for the day also a really nice way to treat yourself as well because some Sometimes on campus, let's say you want to go to your favorite restaurant and sometimes it's too far away from the campus. So Grubhub is another easy app that you can download and you can get your food. It's another pro tip about downloading Grubhub is as a Colorado State student, you do already get discounts. So I'm already a Grubhub Plus member and sometimes I don't have to pay for the delivery fee and that's amazing. Last but not least, this is the final app I suggest downloading. It is called Laundry View. This app is super duper important when you are here on campus in your dorm because it lets you know what machines are available for you to be able to wash your clothes. Um, this app is super duper easy. All you have to do is you download the app, you type in what hall that you're in, and then automatically you're pushed to a screen that tells you which washers and dryers are available. And it's also easy because that way you're not spending all your time collecting all your clothes. You go downstairs and then all of them are full. So this is very convenient. I believe every college student the school offers this app you should download it it's very convenient and it saves a lot of time and once again the app is also free so that is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed it i know that this video was a little short but i have a vlog coming for you guys next week so stay tuned for that and if you are new here make sure to subscribe to the rams life youtube channel make sure to check out some of the other vloggers videos and i will see you guys next week bye